That breaking news out of Truckee tonight. A jet crashes while approaching the Truckee Tahoe Airport. That you see it erupting in flames. And tonight, it's clear nobody survived. Thanks for joining us. I'm Tony Lopez. And I'm Marley Ginter. Our news at 6, also streaming live on CBS and Sacramento right now. That jet went down this afternoon near the Ponderosa Golf Course. CBS 13's Laura Hafley is in Truckee tonight. Laura, you just got briefed by authorities, so what are you learning at this point? Well, the newest information from the Nevada County Sheriff's Office, there were multiple people on board this jet plane and no survivors. The plane did make contact with the control tower here at the Truckee Tahoe Airport before crashing onto the Ponderosa Golf Course nearby. But there are still a lot of unanswered questions. We did ask uh, officials if weather or smoke played a factor in this crash of of course, there are several wildfires burning nearby. They were not able to say if uh, that did play a role in this plane ultimately going down. We were told that there was a fire that started on the ground because of the crash. It was put out very quickly. Investigators also say it's an extremely residential area, so very lucky that no one on the ground uh, or on that golf course was hurt during this crash. We did speak to a witness who watched that plane go down. I mean about to putt and I heard an aircraft coming in low and I knew that sounded too low to be going into the airport. So I looked around and it looked like just over the treetops, what looked like a twin engine commercial plane started <clears throat> banking to its left and went down, it looked like it was going down on its nose and left wing. Parts of the Now, we were told by officials here that that jet plane is capable of holding up to 14 people. That's including crew members and passengers. Again, we do know there are no survivors, but we don't know how many people were on board this plane. And I want to go back to that fire that started on the ground because of that crash. Several fire engines responded, including uh, an engine a strike team that was actually on its way back to its station from the Tamarack fire. So it was really all hands on deck to get that fire out again. Unfortunately, Unfortunately, no survivors. As soon as we learn more about why this plane went down, of course, we will let you know. That's so tragic and still a lot more to learn as to what caused this crash and really about all of the people who could have been on board. Yeah. All right, Laura, thank you for that update. Let's show you some pictures now of the type of plane that crashed. It was a Bombardier CL600 jet. It is considered a luxury personal jet and typically has two seating sections. This is the second plane crash near the Truckee Tahoe Airport in recent weeks.